for Ernie and Andre from Tony, yes. read by Tony. Was the night before Christmas on 50th Street, where yearly we go to meet and to greet, to eat and to drink, and mostly make merry, a night that becomes most extraordinary. <laughs> Presents tumble like waterfalls, fall like the rain. We get gifted like mad again and again. Ernie and Andra, hostess as supreme, they may appear simply human, but they're not what they seem. <laughs> they're dancing with suspect right from the start. <laughs> too splendid by far, too state of the art. <laughs> they're not of this world. There's something amiss. And the thing that confirmed it? Christmas. <laughs> <laughs> I discovered their secret, and here is the kick. These two are in league with the elves and Saint Nick. <laughs> I found there's a workshop, it's not around here, where Corvino elves work on our presents all year. <laughs> Gifts carefully tailored with each person in mind, creative, distinctive, or one of a kind. Then comes the time when Christmas draws near, and the gifts must be moved from workshop to here. <laughs> I looked out the window on just the right night, saw a sleigh and eight reindeer, caught them mid-flight <laughs> with a little old driver so lively and quick. But hold it a minute, that isn't St. Nick. Up to the rooftops the reindeer they flew, and the driver called out in a voice that I knew. Now chasse, now coupe, <laughs> now car for red. Now, see son failli in a big assemblée. <laughs> to the top of the steps, to the top of the wall. Now, grand jeté, grand jeté, grand jeté all. <laughs> the sleigh, though it flew, had its balance maintained. Those reindeer, of course, were Corvino trained. <laughs> <laughs> Maestro Dolce, I saw, was the one in command. And he turned to me then with a wave of his hand called out loud and clear as they flew out of sight. Merry Christmas to all, and to all a good night. <laughs> 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 <laughs>